Preloaders, VI Preloaders, welcome back guys. Always a pleasure to have you guys here with me. And you know this, or at least you should by now. Guys, 2022 is already starting out to be a great, great year. A lot of good things coming. And I have something else I wanna share with you guys. But before I get to that, let me address the people that are probably here for the first time. Hey guys, welcome to you as well. My name's Robert. I'm a retired NYPD Highway Patrol motorcycle lieutenant. I did a wonderful 22 year career with the NYPD. 15 of those years were spent with the elite NYPD Highway Patrol motorcycle unit. The name of this channel is called Robert Simmons Paying It Forward. And on this channel, I share my knowledge, experience, and training that I received from the elite NYPD Highway Patrol motorcycle unit with you guys with a special focus on slow speed motorcycle operation. And I focus on that because that's the skill most motorcycle riders don't have. And they're fearful of it, and I understand the intimidation, but it's important to realize it's not difficult to learn, but it is important that you learn it because that skill is really determining whether you actually know how to operate your motorcycle. All right, you need to be able to ride at slow speeds, control that motorcycle, know how to use the clutch, the throttle, the friction zone, the rear brake, all of that stuff. Um, and that's what I'm here to help you guys with. I wanna help you be the boss of your motorcycle. And all that means is I want you to not be intimidated by it. The boss is not intimidated by the subordinates, right? I want you to be in 100% control. I want you to ride with confidence. So important to have confidence. I want you to make right turns, left turns, and the infamous U-turn and not even have to think twice about it. Okay, primarily, that's what this channel is about. I also do private lessons. You can check the description section for a link or go to my website. And I do practice sessions, usually on a weekly basis, right here in Pula, Georgia. You can go to my website for information on that or the description section of the link in there. And I also do product reviews and, and product installations on my motorcycles and anything that I feel is gonna be relevant or beneficial to you guys, Preloader Nation, I'm always gonna share it. Now, guys, when this video started, did you notice that it said sponsored by Tab Performance? All right, so they're not just sponsoring this video. Tab Performance, I'm happy to announce this, guys, so excited. Tab Performance is now an official sponsor of Robert Simmons Paying It Forward. And listen, I'm, I'm very excited and happy about that. Um, I'm humbled by it. I wanna thank Tab Performance for, you know, reaching out to me and believing in me and wanting to support me and what I do for you guys. So yes, guys, Tab Performance, Robert Simmons Paying It Forward, we're working together now, and I couldn't be happier about that. So speaking of Tab Performance, guys, if you're not, if you're not familiar, this is Valiant. Valiant is my 2019 uh, Street Glide CVO. And Valiant has a full tab performance exhaust. 4.5 inch slip-ons with the zombie baffles and full headers. We also did a dyno tune on it. Um, and but Valiant already had a stage three. So it already has the cam and the, it already had a high flow um, air filter. But Valiant is a beast. If you hear this motorcycle, she is a beast. I mean, it just sounds good. Now, I've done a video on the installation of the slip-ons and the headers. I took it out to Harley Davidson, Falcon Fury Harley Davidson, and they did the work. Um, check out that video. I'll put a link for it right here. I'll also put a link in the description section. She's a beast. And just recently, this is Blaze. Blaze is my 2021 Road Glide CVO. Blaze also has 4.5 inch slip-ons, tab performance slip-ons with the zombie baffle. And that's it, everything else is stock. Um, now, but let me tell you something, just putting these slip-ons on Blaze, OMG, what a huge difference. She's not as loud as Valiant, but she's 10 times louder and sounds better than the stock pipes that were on this motorcycle. Now, I, of, I often say, hearing things on the video is never gonna compare, never gonna compare to how it sounds um, in person. So you, you really have to hear these things in person, but I'm also gonna link the video for Blaze, the slip ones that I did on her. I'll put that in the description section as well, and the link up here. Again, if you're on a smart television, you're not gonna see anything. Now, some of you may also know that I just installed 
some tab performance slip-ons on Violet. Violet is my 2021 limited CVO. And those are the 50 cals. I mean, those are just beautiful, right? At least in my opinion, they're beautiful, beautiful pipes. And I got a good response from a lot of you guys. You agree as well. They're just, they're phenomenal, right? Phenomenal looking. And then I said to myself, wow. Now we all know, if we don't all know, you're gonna find out now, the limiteds don't have stretched bags, right? So with the 50 cals on the limiteds, the pipes are just sitting, you know, they're kind of like just sitting under the bag. So I said, how would those 50 cals look on Valiant, right? Or even Blaze. But how would it look on a motorcycle period with stretch bags with this cutout so that we can kind of fill up this well area more? Ah, all right. And you guys know on, on, on Violet, I did a, a straight cap at the end, a, you know, and I like the way that looks on that motorcycle. But on these motorcycles, I have a slant tip. All right, guys. So today, today's video, I'm going to be installing some 50 cals on Valiant, right? And I'm excited about that. It's going to be with the slanted tip so we can fill that well area a little bit more. Um, and they're, they're going to sound the same because everything on the inside of that pipe is the same. They have the zombie baffles, uh, but 50 cal. All right, let's do an unboxing. All right, guys, as always, I have not taken them out of the box yet, so I don't know what they look like. Let's do it. But you know I'm excited. This box is heavy, too. Instructions. Zombie sticker. Oh, beefy. Woo. Okay, I'll leave that in the plastic for now. All right, guys. Oh, you know what? And I lucked out this time, guys. And here's why I say that. Ooh, look at that, guys. <laughs> look at that. That is beefy. And the reason I say I lucked out is because this is where it attaches to the pipe and the tips already came in a direction that I'm gonna put them anyway, so. That is perfect. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, guys. Oh, just look at them. All right, guys, so I'm not messing around. Let me put these on the motorcycle and um, I'm not gonna take you through the whole process of me putting them on. It's very simple. You take off a couple of bolts, you know, shimmy the pipe out, put the other one on, put the bolts back on. If you are interested in seeing some more details on taking off the old slip-ons and putting these on, just check out the video I did with Violet in installing those 50 caliber tab performance pipes and that'll help you out. All right, all right, let me get these on this pipe. Let me get this off. I can't wait to show it to you guys. There's nothing wrong with your te televisions, guys. Nothing wrong with your television. Because I, you know, I don't want to say anything. I just want you to look at these pipes. OMG. 50 cows on the left, 45 cows on the right. Please put in the comment section, guys. Let me know which one do you like better. Now, I'm not trying to influence your decision or anything. You notice I'm still not on the camera. I don't want you looking at me. I want you looking at these pipes. Listen, like I said before, I'm an ostentatious type of guy when it comes to certain things and these pipes fit the bill. All right, I'm just gonna let you know which one I like best. <laughs> right here, baby. Oh my God, look at those 50 cows. They look good, they look good. And another thing I'm happy about is I didn't have to you know, change one pipe and leave the old one on the other side and then so I can show you a comparison. The fact that I have the 45 calibers, 4.5s on blaze on the right side, 
The back of the motorcycle of the Street Glide and the Road Glide is exactly the same. So I can just put them side by side so that you guys can see the difference, right? Again, still like the 4.5s, but love, love these. Oh, they look so nice. They fill up that area so nicely. All right, let me take the bikes off of the jack and I'm gonna take this outside, start it up so I can give these pipes a fresh cold start. And again, it shouldn't sound any different um, because the first part, the front part of the pipe is still 4.5. It just goes out, but you never know. So let's see. All right, guys, so I'm, this time I put the camera further back because last time I put the camera behind this motorcycle with this tab performance exhaust, it knocked my camera over. So, okay, here we go. the fact that she not only looks mean, she sounds mean. Right, let me do a couple of U-turns. You know I gotta do my U-turns. Again, it sounded good before, but you know, sometimes the mental starts taking over and because it's beefier, it sounds, it, 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 it seems like it, it seems like it sounds even better, right? But it's the same. All right, guys, let me just give you a walk around showing you these pipes. I'll try to show it to you from as many angles as possible. I just love, love the way these look. Beefy guys, right? Beefy. All right guys, go inside, wrap up this video. Got another surprise for you. All right guys, so I'm beyond pleased. You know, I was, I was satisfied with the 4.5s and these are just, they're an upgrade in my opinion. You know, again, if that's something you're into, if you like a smaller pipe, then this is not going to be for you. But based on the look of it, the way it fills in this area, for me, oh, it's just beautiful. I love it. So, so again, I want to thank Tap Performance for providing me with this exhaust so that I can share it with you guys. I'm very, very happy with it. Very happy with it. And I highly recommend it. Again, you're getting a good product from them, but you're also getting great customer service. There's good people over there, all right? And I appreciate that. You call them up, you're gonna actually get somebody on the phone. Um, and that means a lot to me. So guys, you might be asking, well, what are you doing with the pipes that you took off of the bike? All right, I'm gonna talk to you guys about that in a separate video uh, in the future. I'm thinking about raffling them off or something like that. And when I say raffling them off, it's gonna be a giveaway. Like there's nothing for you to give me as far as monetary to enter the raffle. But I'll talk about that in another video. Anyway, that's gonna do it for me guys with this um, install and this review on these Tab Performance 5.0 50 caliber slip-ons with the zombie baffle. Highly, highly recommend. I love them. I can't wait to take this thing out for a ride. She's gonna be ready for, um, for Daytona and I have Tab Performance to thank for that. All right guys? All right, listen. I know that there's anything you guys could be doing with your time and the fact that you choose to spend a little bit of it with me. I appreciate that. If you like this video, if you like any of the videos that I put out, please 
hit that subscribe button guys, hit the like button, and if you wanna be notified when future videos come out that I make, hit the notification bell and switch it to all. You don't wanna miss anything guys, good, good information coming from this channel, all right? I wanna acknowledge my brothers and sisters in blue guys, please be careful out there, and know that you're appreciated. A special shout out to the elite NYPD Highway Patrol Motorcycle Unit, particularly Highway 1 because that's where I worked, and the Highway District, that's where the motorcycle school is. That's who taught me how to ride these motorcycles the way I ride them. But guys, as I always state, it does not end there. You have to keep practicing. This is a perishable skill. Seat time does not equal practicing, guys. You have to actually go out there and put your mind to it and practice, okay guys? So please, practice, 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 practice. Preload and keep it loaded. And practice, 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 guys, because practice breeds confidence. And a confident rider is not only a safer rider, it's a rider that's gonna enjoy riding their motorcycle way more, guys. I guarantee it. Until next time.